All right, hello YouTube. So today I found an issue that I resolved with Rainbow Six Siege, and this Rainbow Six Siege will keep on crashing. And mainly it's okay. I would suggest downloading first MSI Afterburner, and let me just run it through and see let me show you what it is. So what this does is allows you to see your CPU your GPU and all your cores in game and your frame rate in game you know what's giving you the problem and what I found was is that this problem was associated with my CPU and not my GPU and I always thought it was my GPU so I actually, I actually upgraded my GPU to a 1050 from a 750 so I'll show you what I did to fix this problem so first what we can do is go to file explorer then go to documents then go to my games rainbow six siege press on this memory location folder and then press on game settings on i and i and now what you want to do is you want to scroll down maybe a little bit like three-fourths of the way and then you'll see fps limit and when you see it it'll be zero but what I did was I just kept mine at 60 because that's what most monitors are able to uh, display. So I set mine to 60. And if you want, you could set yours even lower to maybe 50, uh, 50 or 45, whatever you feel is necessary. Just make sure you cap it at a certain limit because when it's at zero, it just, it, it'll fluctuate. There's no set um limit so your CPU will keep on trying to increase the CP uh, the frame rate and and then after a point once it reaches 100% capacity on your CPU it'll just crash so then press on file save X out of this and let's say that didn't work out for you and so what another solution would be is to open up Steam right click Rainbow Six Siege press on property go to local files and then go to browse local files. So once you're over here, scroll down until you see, scroll down almost all the way, and then press on Rainbow Six Siege, right click it, then go to properties, compatibility, and then run this program in compat compatibility mode for Windows Vista Service Pack 2. And disable full screen affirmations, run this program as administrator. Then press on apply and then OK. And then if that didn't work out, there's a Rainbow Six Battleye.exe. So you right click that, go to properties, go to compatibility, and just do run this program as an administrator. Do not run this program in compa compatibility mode for a different one because this is an anti cheating service. So they do need the Windows 10 uh, compatibility mode for it. So then press on OK. Exit out of this. And exit out of this. And then play your game. If you have any issues, uh, please let, them, let me know in the comments down below. I will be making more videos on certain crashes in games and how to fix them. And so please uh, like and subscribe the video and subscribe to me if you if this video worked out for you. Uh, if, there's, if there's anything you need, let me know in the comments. I'll do my best to answer everything.